All right, so I decided to go ahead and get back into ZBrush after not messing around with it for a while. And I learned a new way of being able to bring in a reference. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna go over here to texture, go down to import, go to your image, wherever you have it, and then bring it in. You need to go back to textures, click your image, click add to spotlight. It brings your reference in. Now you're gonna wanna scale it down. Have to bring, you wanna bring this circle out. Then scale it down to the size that you want. Not that, right here. Go ahead and mess it up. Bring the OP all the way up. And then you're gonna move it to wherever you want it. All right, now the hotkey to turn on and off that wheel is just Z. And the hotkey to turn the whole thing off is Shift-Z. Now, what I was having problems with was modeling my reference. Bring in a sphere just to show you. Edit, make polymesh 3D. Mm, it's already standard, okay. So look, I'm trying to sculpt on it and it won't work, all right? But if I draw inside on the reference, okay, I'm going to take, move it over to move, bring it over, look, see, it was working. Now, the reason why was because the uh, spotlight projection was on. Okay, you wanna turn that off, and then go back to draw, and look, it's working now. All right, now the way to find that spotlight projection is you gotta go over here to brushes. Go to brushes, go down to samples, and then go down to bottom of it and you got spotlight projection there. Turn it on and off there. Now if you wanna make it easier like I did to bring it in to the bottom is you got to go over here to preferences, config, enable customize then come back over to brushes go back down to samples hold Control alt and then left click on it and drag it down to here or wherever you want it to make it easier for you to find it then you got to go back to your preferences and then turn enable off and then hit store config and that'll make it to where whenever you come back on to your zbrush it'll automatically be wherever you left it and you can do that with all the other tools as well to modify the ui the user interface to make it to where it's easier for you to work all right hopefully that helps have a good one